<laughs> Even my family asked me, I'm like, come on, I can't pick one. You know, it's like, it's impossible. You have a question right there? It's been fun. I've had a ton of fun. It's cool because um, I think the guys on our team, like, they're so, they're, we're all like a bunch of friends. It's like you're back in high school or your Pee Wee team. You go out and have fun at practice and, you know, you look to the weekend, you're like, oh, I get a day off. And then the day off hits, you're like, oh, man, I want to be back playing football. So it's been, uh, it's been a lot of fun. I've, uh, it's a lot different and that's a testament to Klein's culture. Like, it's, it's just been, uh, it's, you know, it's, we compete hard, we work hard, but again, you kind of feel like the day's off, you kind of miss it, which is pretty unique. It's not my culture. It's Lavelle and there's Edward's culture. Yes. <laughs> you don't know him, but... Hey. 30 seconds, 30 seconds. What's your favorite food? That's favorite food? Yeah. Oh, I, I'll say I got this, the ice cream here is probably... <laughs> <laughs> yes. I've had that one. He I'm so hungry. I'm like pumping up my own ice cream. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, 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 I'm every week we get CFP uh, rankings later in the year social media full of every kind of list imaginable if you put out a poll people will vote on it so with that spirit we're going to ask tonight's special guest Keenan Slovis to take part in a ranking game uh, but in this game there are some right and wrong answers at least to our first two ranking questions ranking question number one for Keenan Slovis uh, I'm going to give you I'm going to give you uh, the top five BYU quarterbacks in career passing yardage, okay? okay? I'm gonna give you their names, and you're gonna have to put them in the right order. Oh, God. Uh, <laughs> so, get mad at me. From one, from one through five, and we want you to start with one and then go to okay. five, all right? So I'm gonna give you the five names, and then you go one through five. Okay, here are the names. Your, your boy, John Beck. Okay. Max Hall, Arizona guy. Arizona Both, guy. They're both Arizona guys. Uh, Mason Mountain, you guys. Yes. yes. Uh, Jim McMahon. Okay. Ty Detmer. Okay. And the national champion, Robbie Bosco. Those are the top five in some order. So one through five, what do you think? Career, passing yardage. Oh, you boy. You can start, start with one, you can go one through five. So start with one, who do you think mm -hmm. is number one? Something tells me, I don't know if this is right or wrong, but I'm going to go, Bo Robbie is going to be number one. He's putting Bosco one. I don't know if that's true. Okay. I, don't, okay. I, don't, I don't know anything. Like, everyone's throwing for okay. a crap ton Sorry, of yards. So. Okay, so you can um, go one, one, one through Bosco five. Bosco one. Okay. And Ty Denver won the Heisman. So I think Ty is number two. Okay. Oh, this is hard. Um, can, I ask, can I like ask a clarifying question to narrow this last one down for, for my last ones, I think? Okay. How many years did uh, Jim McMahon start? Well, he had parts of three years as a starter. I suppose three years. Yeah. See, that makes me think John or Max is higher than it because I would put John at three. Okay. Jim at four. Oh, but okay. Max is so recent. I feel like that should be higher. <laughs> I guess I'm going Max Hall at five. I'm sorry, Max. But. Okay. So he's gone Robbie Bosco one, Ty Detmer two, John Beck John's three, recent too. Jim McMahon, Jim McMahon four, at four, and then uh, Max Hall at five. This is probably now, so before, wrong. Before I'm so sorry. I just want to preface. I'm so sorry. <laughs> before, we give, before we give the answer, the correct answer, you got two of these right. Yeah. Okay. Right. Woo! That's like 40% though. That's not, that's not <laughs> super If you complete 40% of your passes, that could be an issue. Yes. No, okay. no, but, uh, so the ones you got right were three and four, John Beck and Jim McMahon. Here's the actual top five. Oh, we have Max. Oh. Then you get Max, and Max will be mad at you for this one. Uh, yeah. Then you get John, Jim, and then Bosco at the very end. I love so, Bosco. He <laughs> 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 did, yeah. I saw his highlight uh, yesterday against Pittsburgh, so I, yeah. I just got excited. I saw him get fired up, and I know that was a big game. So, if, as we saw there, only three BYU quarterbacks have gone over 10,000. And although it was done other places, I mean, most of the yards, he's going to hit 10,000 this weekend. So, what you know, Keaton Slowis has done. <laughs> I'm going to give you the, the, the five names of the top five BYU, active BYU players in career NCAA receiving yards. So these are teammates okay. of yours. Okay? 
So I want the top five teammates from one through five in terms of their career, NCAA receiving yards. I say NCAA because you could include guys that were somewhere else. Right. Hint, hint. Yeah, okay. I got gotcha. you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you I'm here to help. Uh, all right, so one through, I hear your names. Okay. Uh, Darius Lassiter. Yeah. Keelan Marion. Isaac Rex. Okay. Keanu Hill. And Cody Epps. These are teammates of yours. We've got to put them one through five. Career NCAA receiving yardage. Okay, but the oldest one there is Rex. I'm putting Rex at one because I throwing. think he's close to breaking some records too. He's got 21 own. touchdowns. 21 yeah. touchdowns. That's pretty good. Yard, but, yards, but everyone else is younger. And then Darius and Keelan are the transfers. Oh, this is tough. I'm going to go Lassiter at two. Okay. Oh, it might be Keelan though. <laughs> okay, Keelan's at three then. Okay. And then Keanu's at four. I think Cody's at five. Okay, and of this list, Cody, I think he's one. So you put, you put Keelan, you put, uh, okay, yeah. Keanu at four. Oh, Keanu's and tough Keanu, 